Hello and welcome back to some more of Dwarf Fortress with me, the Green Dragon. So, let us continue with great glory and justice. Uh, I have sound sense enabled as you should be able to hear. And um, yeah, we are gonna see about that. I might adjust the volume a bit or turn off some sounds if they annoy me a lot. But for the most part, we're gonna be running with the sound sense from now on. Hopefully that won't cost us too many frames per second. Luckily we have struck a bismuth tonight. Ooh, sexy. I do love bismuth. I love how it looks. I might want to import some castrite in order to make that a thing, but... Right, I did send guys out here in order to do that. That's fine. I'm not sure. I pretty, I'm pretty sure that this is where we left off, but... No, no, I'm not sure. I think I don't remember if I had closed this off or not, which means that I get the feeling that we might be... Things might be screwy, essentially. And you're still making that. Again, bismuthinite. More bismuthinite, right? I mean, right? Ooh, big pocket, big pocket, big money. Sweet. Did order them to dig a lot, and in the process of that... In the process of that, we run into problems in the form of a cavern at F7. And that isn't being even... that isn't even being constructed. Lie containing item again, same bullshit. Why am I not surprised what now? Why, why, why won't you fracking work? Still haven't gotten around to looking that up. I was too busy setting up sound sense, apparently. Okay. Okay, so that's a thing. I'm gonna cancel the job here. I just leave it on repeat like that. For now, anyway. Okay. You are weaving all of this stuff into that, that's fine. Okay, so you are busy killing troglodytes. That is a respectable action. I'm half tempted to actually raid this cavern for benefits. Such as gold and the gems, because there is a lot of nice things in here. I might make this cavern actually open to people. And I might make some steel crossbows and the like. Well, we're actually out of actual iron. Like shit, son. Shit, that is not great. That actually suggests a pretty serious lack of resources. And I really do want ore as much of it as I can get. Because ore makes me happy. And allows me to make nice bismuth bars, which I can then use to make nice pinkish doors. Troglodyte. Oh no. But the troglodyte died. So we're good. Claropole, yeah, that's not as important. That is just plain annoying, though. What have you spent garden right? We have enough garden right, apparently, at this point. I could lower the amounts of actual, you know... You know, the quotas. Or, yeah, lower them. But... I'm not entirely convinced that that is the best idea. Ooh, that's a lot of that, too. You are all the fishermen I designated. Did I not open Dwarf Therapist? Well, let's do that now. You're all the fishermen I designated and essentially my next combat squad. I'm actually tempted to give them some hunting jobs 
in order for them to actually get better. All oh, right, that would take them off of that. Well, maybe not then. Let them fish up whatever they can. How are we on? We are freaking excellent on food reserves, I believe. How are we on prepared meals? Prepare food barrels. Lots of them. So you would have to assume that we are good on that. And it's just cobaltite. Cobaltite doesn't really matter. Again, doesn't really matter. This needs more doors, of course, which we don't have currently, but that's okay. You're all making charcoal and none, no one is working these right now. Yeah, that is not as good as I would like, honestly. How is your skill? Oh, you're nearly at level 1. I assume pretty much all of you are close to it. That's great, you do that for now. I'm thinking that I want to move one of the one of the uh, guys or one of the squads down below if we're gonna keep a cavern open. I just haven't decided if I want to actually keep a cavern open, which is kind of the big question, isn't it? But this cavern would make for a really, really good thing. So that's tetrahedrite that still needs to be worked. Okay. Oh, that's gonna take a while. That sure is gonna take a while, huh? I can't do it. Yeah, this is a slow way to handle things. Did I set up Shift F1? Yes, I did. Good. And they still have some... Actually, they're nearly out of wood. I will order more chopping. Chop. Hmm. Huh. Llama blood barrel, eh? That is very, very interesting. I'm all for the blood of the uh, poor defenseless animals, in fact. I approve of this. I very much approve of this. Speaking of animals. Uh, we have some cats chained up as they should be. We have some ducks as well. Ooh, three of them. Hmm. I don't want to manage that. I, I really don't care about that. I might bring some goats up at some point. Or something, maybe, for someone. Probably not... In this fort, at least not yet. I want six squads, failing that five. At least two of them, uh, you know, archer ones. And down below we have this, but we haven't made a proper, proper place for that yet. Okay, so... Haven't dug down because this ends up open on that account. So it make the thing on this level essentially. Okay, so that would be an up staircase. We would dig out a normal thing here around it possibly. We could go with that and then we could come up with there's gold here. Yep, there is a tiny amount of gold here, which means there might be a gold vein somewhere in the magma levels as well. Interesting. Uh, but of little immediate practical importance, so something we can ignore. This is not smooth entirely yet, which does suggest that there is... more work to be done by the smoothers. And why have these been unsuspended for fuck's sake? You have enough of that. Didn't some of them get suspended? 
we should soon have a basic working amount of steel, right? Oh wait, iron is one of the deficits because we use so freaking much of it. Hmm. Well, uh, all these should eventually fill up, but the two remaining slots I am going to devote to limonite to increase the proportion of our smelting that is, you know, actual iron, because that's like a basic necessity as opposed to just really cool. Meanwhile, you can go home and we shall wall this off. Oh, is there any way? Don't want to automatically select materials, because that's stupid. There we go. Yes, I'm well aware. Warm stone. Warm bloody stone. All of the warm stone. Yes, thank you. I'm sure we're all very impressed with your dedication to being a pain in the ass. Dig. Now, how do we approach this? Let's see, if we dig out a pocket like this, that's... That is in fact... This could work. Okay, that does go down like that. So we could dig out this. This would give us eight spots here. It's not ideal by any stretch, but it's a goodish start. Then we can just dig like so, like so. That gives us another two. And here. That ought to be enough of a pocket to leave us covered. Oh, well, that wouldn't work. So maybe not there, maybe not that top part. But like this we could do it. Right. So that leaves us with that. Okay, what if we... I mean, that would create openings if we actually dug it like this, but what if we dig it like this? Uh, that ends up right on the stairway though, which I, again, really don't like. Just... Chill for a second, you digging morons. Just chill. I'll dig that out, certainly, but... Okay. Okay, I need a place where I can dig out in relative peace. Okay. So how much do I actually need? Let's say for the sake of argument that we want four smelters and at least two forges, maybe a couple magma kilns and magma glass furnaces. Okay, how many do we actually want? That's the question. I'll keep the two wood furnaces upstairs. Obviously, for obvious reasons. Uh, we can have four smelters down here and four wood furnaces up above. Let's go with four forges and then have another four spots for secondary things. Have a tiny place like here maybe. This will be right over a thing and that will be a pain in the ass to dig but it will work. And then we can have something more traditional here. Like this. Yeah, I like this. Yep, that's the correct size. And then we can try and dig out some storages maybe up above. We can just dig out a thing like this. 
Oh, we can open up the whole place, actually, come to think of it. Just have a... Actually, now that I think of it, let's make a landing here. And then we can just... It's a bit asymmetric, but we can just go straight off the landing there. And that ought to work. Then it's just a matter of setting it up yay, this way, and we're good. We're ready to roll. We will need to head down here in order to dig this out, but that should be fine. I think we're gonna go with that. Has and it's suddenly summer. Yay okay, for summer! I really think it's high time we started working on actual magma forges because we kind of need them. We kind of need them due to the... Don't you dare die on me. It's not gonna die, just press the narrow key, so... It's thinking the game is non-responsive, which it is, because it's busy saving, because it does that. It really, honestly, does do that. And here we go. Excellent. Stock level is low. Stone blocks. Okay. H. F8. There we go. That ought to be good. What the fuck are you playing? For... They're sparring? Okay, whatever. Just chill. Seriously? Am I gonna get this crap every time you spar? Of course I will. Why the fuck wouldn't I? I'm gonna have to obviously disable that. And obviously here we're gonna have this constant pausing bullshit. Yes, I know. Which is why I don't like it, obviously. Or why I don't like doing it this way, anyway. Yes, I know, warm stone. We're all very scared. Dig those corners. Expose as much warm stone as you can in a single sitting to avoid the butt hurt of. Oh no, it's lava! Because the dwarves do get upset about that crap a lot. I know, I know, it's like... Oh no, the burns! The burninating! It's like Trogdor is here! But, listen, guys. No, no, no. Listen, I need you to, like... Dig, but not insanely stupidly if you can, okay? Okay. This is why I like to let the magma in you know, at a later date and dig out a little pocket for it to sit in first, because it's just... It's less of a uh, high pain in the ass. Of course they're gonna be upset. We do have a lot of people who can dig, so most of our manpower is, I assume, just digging all the various tunnels and stairways we have ordered at this point. Which is admittedly fine, it's just something to keep in mind since our manpower is tied up in this. Take that. And that. Okay. God damn it, it's paused. I really, really don't like the way this function is set up. It, it, it kind of it's up being annoying, especially when it zooms you in a weird direction. Yes, yes, I know. It's bad. Oh no, the horror. The incomprehensible horror. Yes, it's hot. 
For fuck's sake, it's snowstorms outside. Just relax, we're in the deep south. You should be happy there's some magma. Also gold veins. Sweet. Is there any way I can extend this in a way that won't slaughter everyone? Not sure I can. Okay, what if we build a... Hmm... Well, this. A 9 by 9 thingy. There's no way that will build decently, but have to try, don't we? So if, if I channel this out, that would let the magma in here and people would have a cow. I'm half tempted to actually open it up right now, but we can't, because then we won't be able to recover the bodies. Oh, and it won't be a legitimate kill. So we're just gonna let them dig out normally, and then we're gonna screw them in some other way. Don't worry, I'll think of something, it's gonna be okay. Also, just dig, will you? Yep, here we go. Looks good. Looks very good. And here, it's still just bad. Wonderful. What did we strike? Claropo. Claropo. Hello. That would indeed be down here. Dig it out. Dig it out and it'll be awesome. Because I do like gems. Gems make me happy. Question is, at this point, where the fuck do I want to store my actual metal? Ores. I mean metal ores, not metal per se. And I think here, or rather here, level above. I honestly think that that's probably best. Damage, nice. Dig them out anyway. Actually, let's make them a priority thing, huh? See? Now people are gonna have a cow anyway due to reasons. Who the fuck is? Why? Fine, important messages only. Jesus Christ, these fucking dwarves. Just... They just don't stop. They ju just don't let up. Okay, so this is a 9 by whatever. Huh. How many total would this be? 15, which means I could squeeze one more set in. That way I could just do it here. Okay. Okay, so we can do 8. But I do want a couple of kilns and a couple of glass workers. Yeah, a couple of glass furnaces, that is. So I suppose we'll focus on that among other things. I'm just gonna have to unpause while this goes on a few times because let me guess it's hot there. You don't fucking say. Dig it anyway. I probably don't want to mine for gold down here because it would suck a great deal with the constant pausing as I work my way through wind, so I won't. I will in fact ignore any gold that we have here. Gods, damn it. Yes, I know. There is a way to turn it off with DF hack, but I don't remember the command. Just annoying of all the stupid design decisions. I mean, yeah, the design and interface of this game could be better. It's an amazing game. 
and the crappy interface even adds to the charm, but still. You know, still. Yes, I know, I know, it's a thing. It's a thing, it's fine, keep working at it. So we have that dug out. Over here we will essentially be a thing as well. Alright. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. So that would be here or yeah, here essentially. So all of these would be connected anyway, right? So naughty fuck's sake So nobody would actually be without magma would they? Okay Someone go over there and uh, Channel that out. I need access to the magma below or rather, that chamber needs to have access to the magma below, here. So it starts filling up properly. Magma can be turned into obsidian with a bit of water. There are ways in order to turn all of this into a non-issue. Hmm. We want to do it in such a way that seals off this little pocket here and possibly some pockets around here. In order to avoid a certain amount of badness, namely that of our four, uh, furnaces running out of power due to us killing all the magma. But there are ways, are ways, are ways to screw with that, especially in terms of getting to all of the adamantine, which is an extremely valuable thing, because we are on a candy quest. Candy Quest! Yes, Mr. Surgeon. Do it! Do it! Make the magma thing. Make it a thing. Yes. Now we can see things flowing in. Nobody cares. Fuck off. And things are obviously just slowly starting to flood in here, which is as it should be. We're gonna fill it up with glory. It's gonna be great. I could always only dig the visible stuff, and that would fix a lot of problems in theory. In theory. Apparently we're losing magma levels from, well, there. But, eh, I, does anybody really even care? I'm just trying to limit the amount of annoyance we're gonna go through, incidentally. It's a thing I'm trying to do. And yes, the timer was a while ago. So thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And I'll see you guys in next episode. So see you then.